we're swishing, so we're going to blend. One of the most interesting things that I found out in terms of biological evolution of, um, in terms of beauty, there's two actually. One is something called neoteny, is like this need to look younger and this com competition amongst women or females actually um, to look younger. So people try to get the bigger eyes. Even our bodies have evolved to look younger, like the smaller ears, the smaller feet. That's actually not, Natural selection doesn't do that, um, but sexual selection does, which I thought was very interesting. Um, the other thing is that beauty is a signal to show that everything's okay inside, that you're healthy. So if there's one eye that's off, that means there's not symmetry going on in your body. And symmetry is hard for the body to produce. So if you're symmetrical, it means you're healthy and fit, you know. There's so many advancements in technology that you really don't know what's happening with people's skin anymore. You know, they're doing the Fraxel, they're doing the Botox, so they're staying lifted. Um, so you can't really tell what's naturally happening. Because naturally, you lose elasticity in your eyes, and of course Botox helps to bring that back up. You get sunspots, Fraxel helps to dissipate that. Um, one of the big things when you get older is that you actually lose lashes and brows. So one of the really big signs of youthfulness is full brows. So you want to add that back in, especially as you age. With eyebrows, I'm using a lighter color just because your hair is lighter to kind of give uniformity. And then I use like the lightest touch and just basically fill it in very lightly. Basically reverse and do it on the bottom. And since I'm trying to when we do the darker colors, we're actually bringing the eyes out. So skincare is huge because that'll help to prevent future aging. Um, the sun is a big factor, so I don't do Botox, I don't do any of that stuff, but what I do do is sunscreen, and I do that religiously because it actually makes a huge impact on the way that my skin um, develops. Um, also, as you age, the melanin in your skin dissipates, so it doesn't matter um, how light you are or how dark you are, you lose your melanin as you age, so you want to put that back in, and you focus on adding that. Um, also, the pink in your skin goes away, so you want to add back a little bit more pink. So what's the, what's the order? So you wash your face and then what do you put on? And then you put a toner. You can exfoliate. You don't have to exfoliate that often, um, but you want to exfoliate, then you do the hydrating toner, then you do the serum, and then you do the moisturizer. And mm. then you do the sunscreen, and then you do the foundation. <laughs> One of my favorite, okay, there's a couple of favorite supplements that I like is um, the B complex, of course, the B12, um, B6 complex, and fish oil. I'm a huge fish oil person. <laughs>